can't handle my life right now. Um, it's about 11.30. I'm at work right now. Oh, I need to charge my camera. I have like no battery. Um, I'm super bad at remembering to charge this. So I'm gonna go do that like right after this clip. Um, but I just thought I'd pop in and say I have been working. It's been a productive day so far, which is good. And I think I'm gonna get Subway for lunch. Um, I really, really wanted it. And then I got a coupon, so... I might, I might do that. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, I'm not really sure why I started vlogging. I usually don't start vlogging until after I'm done with work, but I just picked up my camera and started and I'm glad I did because I'm realizing that it is dying. So I'm going to go plug the camera in now and I'll see you guys when I'm done with work. Hi guys. So, um, I am done with work for the day and I, uh, have to film the video but before i do that i actually want to do a little bit of training with december it's been a while since we've done some training i kind of want to try to teach her some new stuff so i think we're gonna do that for a little bit should help give her a little bit of energy she's just been snoozing all day have you been snoozing all day have you been doing a sleep do you want to go train you want to go work on your tricks yeah, we haven't worked on them in a while, have we? No, Mom, I want to go back to sleep. Will you get hot dogs? <sighs> yeah. Yeah. So I'm going to start by kind of running her through all of the tricks that she already knows, and then we're going to work on some of the ones that we... I'm trying to remember, like, all the last ones I was, like, trying to teach her. It's been a while since we've done training. Um, but I'm going to start by running through all the tricks that she already knows. Hi, December. All right, you ready? Can you lie down? Good girl. December. Bang. Good girl. Sit. Good girl, lie down. Roll over. No, roll over. I know, I know, you get too excited sometimes. Lie down. Roll over. Good girl. There you go. High five. High five. Good girl. Number. Bless you. Sit. Good girl. Shake. December touch. Good girl, December touch. Good girl, December touch. Good girl. There you go. Hi, right, December. Good girl. Through. Does he through? Through. Good girl. There you go. Good girl. Watch me. December through. Good girl. Good girl. In case anyone was wondering, I have to throw December the treats because she's got very bad depth perception and a lot of times she will like accidentally <laughs> bite my finger while I'm trying to get her to do what she's supposed to do. So that's kind of why I have to throw the treats to her. All right, December what? Sit. Good girl, watch me. December through. Uh-uh. <laughs> through. Good girl. Good through, December. Good girl. Good through. All right, this time I'm going to try combining it with the hand movement, okay? Because I don't want to have to go behind my legs every time. So we're going to try using a hand movement, see if you can figure it out. You got it? Ready? Watch me. December. Through. Through. Come on. <gasps> Good girl! There's a clever dog, December. There's a clever dog. Come here. No, sit. Watch me. December. Through.
girl. Watch me. You watching me? Good girl. Pause up. Come on. Pause up. Yes, good girl. There you go. Good girl. You're such a good girl. Are you ready? Can you do it? I believe you can do it. Ready? Three. Good girl. There you go. Give me a high five. Oh, good girl. There you go. You did such a good job, December. You did such a good job. Are you learning new things? Are you learning new things? Oh, yay. Oh, yay. Oh. Girl, you learned two new tricks. We'll work on them some more tomorrow, huh? She's all tired out now. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to get things kind of set up for filming. So I'm gonna... Bright! <laughs> I'm gonna be filming the dollar store challenge today. Um, I went and got all this stuff a while back and it has been a while since I uploaded a challenge video, like a proper challenge video. Obviously I uploaded my April Fool's Day video, but um, this is the wrong one. <laughs> uh, so, but I don't think I'm gonna film the whole process. Um, I have this idea in my mind for a sketch, but I think it's gonna be kind of a little bit more com complicated than I usually do. So I don't think I'm gonna sketch it on camera just because I have a really hard time sketching on camera. Um, you can't really get that close to the paper because you have to keep the paper, like the cat, like, so the camera's here, right? Like facing down and then you have the paper. And if I wanna like get on top of the paper to like see, I kind of have to lean and then my head goes in front of the camera, you know? So if I wanna sketch, um, I either have to like not record it, but if I want to record it, then I need to kind of have the cam either be aware of the camera and then kind of sketch far away. And then I can't, um, it's harder for me to be details or I have to put the camera kind of towards the side, like from an angle. Um, and I'm not sure that I feel like doing that today. I have all of these like papers just like floating around and I have so much shit that I need to organize. But once this video is filmed, like. That's it, I can start packing up my art desk because I will not be using it for about three weeks. Um, so I guess that will help because I'll be forced, I'll be forced to organize things then. Um, but yeah, so uh, because I kind of have this idea in my head and I think it might be a little bit more of a detailed drawing, which is really stupid to do for this challenge because like the brushes I have are terrible. Where did that go? There it is. Um, but anyway, uh, I think I'm gonna kind of sketch that like on my couch, like watch videos and such like while I do that and then I'll film the actual coloring process. Um, but before I do that, I wanna do, oh my God, I cannot handle my life right now. Where are my colored pencils? They're not in here, they're in the other room. That's fine. Um, I'll just put all of this crap in here and we'll put that on the floor. I don't need to organize everything. This is all going in boxes soon. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'm gonna film uh, at the beginning just like a little, this is everything I got from the dollar store kind of dealio just to show what I picked up. Um, and then I'll make the art and I'm excited. Da -da -da, da -da -da -da. I am actually like in an art creating mood today, so that's good. That's good. Gonna get this done. Boogly 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 boo. I'm an idiot. I think I might have like mildly, well, I don't know if I have like 100% changed my mind, but I did get two pieces, two types of paper. I got this guy, which is like a sketch pad for dry media, and that's quite large. And the watercolor pad I got was this one because this was all I had. Um, so it's not quite big enough to do my original idea, although I may just do a variation on my original idea. So we'll see. Um, I'm gonna do some like thumbnails and stuff like that, and then I'm gonna get started with the sketching. Okay, so I, um, modified my original idea it's still gonna be really hard because this is so small and I'm doing like a full figure um this is definitely not perfect in terms of like anatomy and stuff like that but like I'm okay happy enough with it that I'm gonna sketch it like go forward with it just because um it's such a small piece and like I'd 
it, I feel like I have such a harder time like drawing and sketching when I'm drawing in such like small spaces so I'm like you know what it's okay it doesn't have to be perfect but I think it came out pretty cute um I am drawing okay I don't know how to pronounce his name I know they said it in the books Koth Koth I think it's like Koth Koth um, anyway, uh, from Name of the Wind, uh, if any of you have ever read those books, that's the book that I'm reading right now, um, and I'm really enjoying it, so I just, like, had this idea of drawing him with his loot in a, um, windowsill, so, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and start filming now and, like, refine the sketch and color it, and hopefully I can make it look good. It's looking a little questionable right now, like, I don't know what's happening with this foot. I need to, I need to edit that a little bit, but, eh. Okay, so I'm about to take a little bit of a break to take the dog out and also to let the painting dry so far. I'm also kind of frustrated because I, so my camera can only record in about 10, 11 minute increments and I totally must have spaced on setting the next alarm because I set alarms on my phone so I know when to like set a new clip to start and it stopped recording and I don't know how long it wasn't recording for. I feel like I might have lost like a decent amount of work but that's okay, it's whatever. We're still in the early stages, but I'll show you what it looks like so far. This is what it looks like so far. I actually think it's coming out pretty cute. The paints are definitely tricky to work with. The hardest thing is the brushes. I haven't really touched these guys, which were like the art brushes. These are like that terrible plastic kind with like the really hard end. Um, but I also got these, which are makeup brushes, and these are working pretty damn good. So I'm just using these so far. Um, and I'm starting to kind of like build up the atmosphere and I'm gonna wait for the dry, and then I'm gonna start putting some like colors into his skin and shirt and stuff. But Desi hasn't been potty in quite a while so I thought she might want to go. Yeah. All right, the video is done. That actually really didn't take very long to film probably because it was such a small painting and like, because working with the materials was so difficult, I could only do so much in terms of detail, but this is how it turned out. I think it came out pretty cute, considering what I was working with. Um, I definitely need to like iron it so it's flat, but I actually kind of like it. So yay, that is done. I just need to edit that video. Um, so I think I'm just gonna edit videos for the rest of the evening. Um, if I can get this one edited and maybe even a second one, and get some vlogs edited. Just need to try to start catching up on all of the editing before the move. And that was officially the last YouTube video that I have to film for the next four weeks, if you include this week. Because um, I do have three more videos that are pre-filmed. So I am officially good to kind of start packing and yeah, um, I think one of my goals for this weekend is going to be to try to get all of those videos edited and uploaded so that they will just go out automatically. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get started on that. My bitch ass computer just shut down while I was in the middle of editing my freaking video. It does this all the time. You are a piece of shit. You are a piece of shit and you should feel bad. Oh. This is why. Hey Windows, how about when people are in the middle of fucking projects, you don't decide to randomly update? In fact, at no point should my computer turn off without me telling it to unless it's a, like unless it's crashed. You should not be turning my fucking computer off to update. I didn't want to fucking update. I wanted to do my goddamn work. Okay, so the video is edited and it is exporting right now. It is probably going to take hours to export, so I don't know if I'm going to have time to edit any vlogs tonight, um, which sucks because I am still super behind. Um, we'll see what time it gets finished. I do have to wake up early tomorrow, so I don't really want a late night tonight. I'm going down to the Springs tomorrow and I'm actually going to be there for... I'm gonna be there Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. I'm gonna be there for five days. Um, I wasn't planning on being down there that long. Um, we have a meeting, our new meeting is on Monday. So I was like, okay, well, I'm gonna be down on Saturday and Sunday, so I'll stay for Monday. But I thought that we weren't gonna have our meeting on Thursday because we had the meeting on Monday, but we are having our meeting on Thursday, so I do have to go down tomorrow. And I have stuff over the weekend as well. 
um, like it's my sister's birthday, my dad's birthday, my sister's play, and Easter. So I'll be there for sure Saturday and Sunday. Um, and it doesn't really make sense for me to go down. I mean, I could go down tomorrow and come up tomorrow evening and then go back down Saturday during the day. But that just seems pointless. I just don't like being down there for that long with December because she has to stay in the garage. She can't come in the house. She will eat the cats. Um, she does have like a really nice setup in there, but I do feel bad being down there for that long. So I haven't decided yet what I'm gonna do. I gotta figure that out. <laughs> I'm guessing this video is not gonna be done till at least 10 or 10.30, so I'm gonna hesitate a guess that there are not gonna be any vlogs getting edited today. But I have decided I am gonna go home for the whole five days, taking the dog. I just went over to my neighbor's and asked if she could take care of my plants. So I dropped off my plants with her. Actually, I just dropped off the fern. I think the succulent will be fine for five days. I just think the fern might need one or two water waterings. Um, by the way, I've named my fern Ficus because I have this tree over here, which is a ficus and her name is Fern. And if you understand why I have a ficus named Fern, if you get that reference and you're not my sister, Hells yes, write it down below. I don't know if anyone will get why I have a ficus named Fern or now a fern named ficus. Um, so I dropped that off with her and she's going to water it for me. And anyway, what was the point of this whole conversation? Oh yeah, so I think uh, I'm gonna be home for five whole days and I won't really have a whole lot to do outside of work. Um, I mean, obviously I'll have like events and stuff like that, but in terms of getting stuff done, I don't need to worry about like filming other than my vlogs. Um, obviously I won't really need to be worrying about cleaning or cooking and all that kind of stuff because I will be at my mom's house. So uh, I should hopefully, hopefully you guys be able to spend this weekend catching up on all of my vlogs and editing all three of the videos that I prep. That is gonna be my goal for this weekend. I think that's a realistic goal in between the stuff I have to do um, and then there's, I mean, like I can't do anything else. Like I can't start packing or anything cause I'm not gonna be there, I'm gonna be here. So yeah, I think that'll be good. So for the rest of the evening, um, I am reheating some pizza from the other day and I'm going to watch some more 13 Reasons Why and just relax. Um, hopefully, I'm gonna stay up until this exports. I think, I don't think it'll be later than 11. It's 28% done right now. Estimated time remaining 57 minutes, but that doesn't mean anything. Um, but yeah, I'm feeling good. Today was a productive day and I wrote on my mirror, like kind of like uh, positive affirmations. It basically said, it was like a list of stuff to do. So it said like, take a shower, um, do makeup, go to work, whatever. And then it also said like, you can do it and don't go back to bed and stuff like that. And that has worked pretty well for me in the past. And it um, I used to like write stuff in my planner and writing it on the mirror definitely helped because it's kind of like your past you telling you that future you can do it when future you doesn't feel like they can do it. Um, I was definitely struggling a little bit this morning. I was really, really, really tired. Um, up in, Up until about like noon, I was exhausted um, but I resisted the urge to take a nap or anything like that I just kept pushing ahead um, so I'm really really proud of myself I feel like today was a good day when you are struggling with depression or pre-depression or whatever I think it's important to kind of focus on the good days and also focus on the little um, the little victories so like taking a shower or doing your makeup or putting on like a real bra i'm wearing a real bra today i'm gonna go change out of it now because i'm officially done with my day but i wore a real bra today and it, like i know that that may sound silly because you're like oh this is stuff that normal people do every day but right now you need to be gentle with yourself and take care of yourself um so yeah if anyone else out there is having a hard time with depression, that's something that does help me. Hey guys, I stayed up way too late watching this TV show, so I'm gonna go to bed. Thanks for watching, see you guys tomorrow. Bye vlog. <laughs>